you fall. Don't worry, I'll never call you that again. We're back among the Tempest Goddess Seas once again to pillage and plunder as the greedy little hearts desire. I'd like to welcome our newest members, and you'll be fast joining the others down in the undertow. If you don't pull your weight, all new crews scrub the decks and work their way up. You're stuck with us now for several weeks. <laughs> now, lads, our next journey will take us to the treacherous waters. We're gonna brace the archipelago all the way till I mesh. If you've ever lifted a purse that was more than jewels itself, you ever rob a man blind while he's straight sober, you ever feel the warm embrace of another's wrapped in soft silk, you can do it all with eye mesh. Anders, and Anders, splice the main brace. Let's drink our weight in this well-earned rum. God, you're boring of song. You have no drinks in your hand, no pink in your cheeks. What did they teach you up there in the ivory towers of yours? That rum was the devil's tricks. <laughs> what a funny one you ended up being, eh? Wouldn't pick you as a crack up. Oh, you were being serious. Then you really must be a boring sort. Huh? What do you mean? Cause I'm gonna tell the crew that we're making port. They're one sailing for us, cutting the jib, all that shite. Listen, if you're gonna sit there and try to take tell me, if you're gonna sit there and trying to tell me how to captain my own ship. You can go and make your own ship from the tatters of your clothes when we maroon ya. I don't tell you how to be royal. Ow! Watch it! Oh, what now? You want the others hearing your silver spoon upbrings? Yeah, alright, alright. I'll shut my mouth. I won't stop calling you princess though. Hey! My ship, my rules. Hmm? No, I'm not drunk. It's you who should be drinking more. You're so uptight and glaring. Could wither at a tree of that icy look of yours. Luckily, I'm immune to icy glares. In fact, I rather enjoy them. I told you I'm not drunk. I'm playing it up. Not as much fun as the crew thinks that you're stone sober. Better to act squiffy than get them all riled. It makes for mocking the hangovers funnier. Our stowaway has some claws. Let's keep our eyes out. At least the grumpy princess starts tossing their foods. Then it'll be quite the cocktail. <laughs> hmm? The sun has barely gone on, you wanna turn in? What happened to those fancy galas and balls we hear about? Yeah, yeah, I know, whatever. Don't get your ropes tied. Just relax. C come on, Sanders should set you up in the main quarters. Yeah, you are a hammock fit for an uninvited guest. And don't worry, we found that folding screen we snagged from the high-end merchant some months ago. Thought we'd sold the thing, but I guess we're buried in the cargo on hold. Oh well. 
what now? Can't you see I'm trying to join the party? It's not good enough. Not to be a poop on your parade here, princess, but this is some high-grade care we're giving here. You're lucky we even had a spare hammock. Oh, you'd be sleeping on the floor with the rats. What more do you expect? What? No, no way. Those are my private quarters. My private quarters. See? It's in the name. Private. As in, no one but myself goes in there unless invited. And you, sweet princess, are definitely not invited. I don't care about some primsy upbringing that you had, five anchors or whatever, your bedroom. We are not bunking together like all those stiff and navy bastards. Giggling the night away with gossip and hair braiding, we're not doing it. You can't order me around here. You're belly royalty on this ship, so you can throw as big as a tantrum as you like. Still not letting you in. Unless... You weren't actually planning on getting any sleep. Is that what you want, princess? Why you keep insisting on joining me in my quarters? Curious about what it's like laying with a captain off the sea? Careful, princess. I'm gonna go around attacking the captain of an enemy ship of drunken pirates. But hey, I'll back off. I forgot for a second that you weren't fun. Enjoy your hammock. Pisces, what the fuck is wrong with you? Why are you sitting in the dark? Couldn't you just find a match to light a candle? Are all nobility is thick-headed? Ignoring that for a second, how did you get in here? I locked my doors. It double bolted. Oh? A master lockpicker, eh? Wasn't expecting that. No. I thought you were going to say something ridiculous. Like what? I don't know. Some kind of royalty powers was my instinct. Turn into a mist and move through a crack of a door. Open the portal and te or teleport it inside. Shit like that. I know Morgan isn't massively open to the idea of magic, but you can't be that stupid to not know about it. I'm positive. You'll have your regular rats jumping into your coffers every once in a while. Usually during tax time. Huh? Princess, you... God, you're an idiot. Coffers means chests, jewelry boxes, anything that carries gold. Not, uh... Not underwear. What do they teach you, actually? I'm being serious this time. What did they actually teach you if you don't know what magic is? Don't know about the Dead Sea? Don't even know about the archipelago? Music, literature, and what? A strange politics. You're making yourself a sadder thought the more you speak. We're gonna have to teach you a few things around here if you ever even gonna consider being a Marigan glorious and faithful ruler. Hmm? Oh, you're not next in line? Well... Huh. Well, guess it takes the pressure off your shoulders. No threat of mad with power then, eh? I don't give a shit anyhow. Anyway, out. You heard me. Get out. You weren't invited, princess. In fact, I remember correctly, I specifically told you you were never invited to my quarters, no matter what. The b and was sneaky, I'll give you that, but you've overstayed. And I wouldn't start making yourself more unwelcome than you already are. Not after the bruise you've left on my cheek. 
Oh, you were defending yourself? Give me a break. Yeah, I am a dick, so what? The door's right there. Excuse yourself, you can't handle it. What are you gonna do about it now? Yeah, I am removing my shirt. I'm getting comfortable. You know, in my private quarters where no other members are still always currently invited. I'd get back in your hammock before one of the other men steal it. By the way, it is a genuinely nice hammock. Yeah, see yourself out. What was that? I wasn't listening because you were in the middle of excusing yourself from my quarters. <laughs> You're just gonna break in again? Ha! <laughs> you wish. Now I know that you can pick. I'll just steal the door and shut with magic. I happen to know a few spells. So just to get out, you're giving me a migraine. Uh, what's wrong with you? Why are you walking like that? You're looking a little green, are you okay? Fuck me. I mean, if you insist. But you don't entirely look complimentous at the moment. Are you... are you getting seasick? You are, aren't you? Sea travel is not really sing well, is it? Have you ever sailed before? Ah, oh, my heart! You wound me, dear princess! Don't go. Don't go getting all sick over my nice rugs. These are hard to come by in the seas. And by good and honest rating as well. Some poor sort of a merchant really didn't have a good day when he decided to cut costs shipping himself. Anyways, I'm rambling. One sec. Here. Yeah. It's not poison. You owe me five mil. I'm not about to kill you. Yet. Anyways, drink up. It'll taste thick and a bit shit, but it'll settle your stomach and stop things from spinning. We pick up a bunch of these potions for new sailors to keep them from seeing the dinner again. The rats are the dirtiest things we've got on the ship. Don't twist this around. I'm not being kind. I like this rug and I don't intend on tossing it. I also don't want to have to deal with you, so drink up or I'll force it down your throat. <sighs> Great gods, I'm not bullshitting you here! See? No poison. Drink. Yeah, I told you it tastes like crap. We'll get another for you next time you feel unwell. We got plenty. You only need a couple before you get used to sailings. Then you'll be right for the journey. Don't look at me like that. I'm just protecting my investments. Already planning what I'll be spending it on, so... I need it. Now go, before I kick you out. Enjoy the hammock, princess. I can't believe we're gonna sail with an annoying brat for two whole months. What a joke. <sighs> Whatever.